Oh, and a skull. Yeah. Okay, nothing really in here. Yeah, that, that's that's what I was thinking, Nick. behind door number 73 it's a safe with some garbage in it give me a reason not to kill you the protonic inversal ring reflects 50% melee damage back at attackers that's pretty fucking neat more of these more lock picking because that is what this is all about lock picking nice Assume this will open that. Thank God. I didn't sign up to babysit your ass. Transports you to another time. Can only be used at specific locations inside the anomaly. Prototype notes. Even though we haven't heard from the doctor in a long time, I've finished up his prototype for the Temp Portal Transverser. Using this device, the user should be able to hijack a slipstream in the temporal flow to t travel travel to another point in this dimension. Who knows what un untold treasures we could access this way. If my estimates are correct, they could contain objects from our similar coordinates, but from any point in time. Before his radioed science, Dr. Ang marked the areas with the most temporal instability using red lights. These are at... These are the places where the prototype will most effective will work most effectively. If I remember correctly, there should be five total. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, Dr. Ang's password. The neuron do not worth my time. Detenter. Increase melee range, ten percent chance to calm your enemy on hit. Granted with guaranteed with critical. Oh. Audio sample monsoon. You have found a re calibration file for the sonic emitter. Take it to a workbench to recalibrate the sonic emitter for new effects. Oh wow. Okay. So I'll open this now. Got it. Got it. Okay. With red lights. Okay. But yeah, this adds in a lot of stuff. I mean, it said it did, but... Okay, let's find... One of these... Temporal... Things. With red lights. Feel a strange sensation. Oh. A schematic protonic inversal throwing knife. Oh. Oh, that's fucking neat. Ionic radial terminator. That sounds demeaning. Oh, radii alternator. Oh, Dr. You Klein's don't glove. Lay into me. Reduces enemy strength by 2, and critical hit reduces enemy resistance by 30, and strength by additional 1. Oh, wow. 299 damage? Jesus Christ, that's a big damage gun. Okay, I'm guessing now I just... Oh, this is fucking awesome. So yeah, I'm actually really impressed with, with this mod. 
Uh, gonna save real quick because I don't know what the fuck this does. Think I can get a brain if I turn 40 of these? I just want to quickly make sure I, I still have the cool ones. Yeah. So I need like four more of those. Okay, that's doable. Ah! Okay, I, I, I know this is gonna be really dumb, but I just, I just want to check. Am I dead? Oh God, am I in Detroit now? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not. Thank God. Oh. Take your sales pitch and shove it up your ass. <laughs> Take. Thanks, me. That was an interesting take on this device. The Neuro Ocular Dome. That sounds like something Facebook is going to try and get you to put on to steal your thoughts. Oh my god. Alright, let's find some more of those, um, temporal rifts or whatever. Don't ask me why I'm picking up all this shit, it's none of your business. I just need it for my collection. been there. I don't think there's anything down here. No. I would assume it's probably like one in all the areas. Living, am I right? My God. Oh, no, I failed a quest. 
so upset about that. Nothing, nothing ruins my day quite like that. All right, let's see what we got. The fuck? Champagne. Son of a bitch. Fire three projectiles, increase damage and reduce spread. Reduce ammo capacity and range. Oh my. Oh. And the schematics for the thing. Look, this is a lot of plastic. You, you, you never know when you might run into all these dog bowls again, you know? Hey, Nick. Goodbye. I guess we'll check that other area, which I can't remember where it was. I guess it's on the other side. Yeah. God damn it, man. Why am I so over encumbered? Because I keep on picking up things. I'm not, like, actually asking the question. I'm not confused but by that. I'm just, you know. What are you going to do? Come on. Leave me alone. Well, thank God I didn't miss that. I would have cried. Oh. That makes sense. Cause who wants to go around the same place? Dr. Klein's well, that's Dr. Klein's glasses. And the schematics for the protonic inversal throwing axe. Oh my. I really like the teleport, I think that's really cool. And so far this has been pretty, um, well made since I haven't had any problems with it. But once we get back to the Commonwealth, then we'll see if it has any problems with crafting things. Alright, yeah, I'm guessing that's it. Alright, let's, uh, head back to the Commonwealth with all of our fucking things. I guess what we'll do is we'll look at um, all the crafting things, I'll, I'll try and find all of them, and then we'll just look at the modifications for everything and go over that, and also look at the workshop items, which I'm really interested to see, because I love having more workshop items, it makes making settlements more fun when you have a lot of things and you can mesh them all together. Plus, I feel like those are going to work really well with my um, new Vault 88 build. That I haven't started working on, but I will because I love building vaults. Even though they're challenging. Oh, look at that. Uh. Okay, for whatever reason, my, contr my controller just quit working. I don't know if that was the game or just my controller, but that's weird. There we go. Okay. Back to Sanctuary. So I'm guessing it'll pop you back out near Diamond City every time. Which is fine. I mean, Diamond City is in like the center of the map. And you can always fast travel. Big fucking new energy. All right. Okay.
I've got your back no matter what. Generates random random items? Okay. Hey, remind me to stay on your good side. Give me those hollow sights. Nope. Okay. Very cool. Let's see if there's anything special for the armor. Okay, so you can give it weaves to it. See. Well, let me check the mod page real quick and see if it says where the things are. Okay, doesn't say. I'm guessing it'll be like decorations. Have so many things it'd honestly be hard to tell where it is. Or does it have its own like little Okay, thank God. Okay. Oh, I like that. You can get some crystals. More crystals. Oh, you. Oh, that that's awesome. You can make safes. A satrine barrier. And more stuff. Okay, that's pretty neat. Kind of just like more or less just aesthetic items. Not really anything too crazy. Can you use the box. You can use the box. All right. Well, I guess that's going to be it for today's video, so if you liked the video, please leave a like. If you want to see more Fallout content, please check out my channel. I do videos like this every single week, and um, let me know if I missed anything in this, because I probably did. Also, one thing I should mention is that I currently have a modded Harry. Fallout 3 playthrough currently going on, so if you want to check that out, I'll have some videos on screen now. But yeah, hopefully I'll see you next one, so yeah, I'll see you.